Hey, I'm the school resource officer here at River Bluff High School. I've been a police officer now for around 40 years, but I've been a school resource officer for going on 14. I uh, re actually retired in 1998 uh, from the Casey Police Department. I came back in the fire department for a year, and then I went out to a middle school. Uh, and I was there three years and spent 10 years at Lexington High School as the school resource officer. Uh, I have three actual functions here at the school. Number one is primary is the safety and security of the school and the protection of everybody that's in the school. Uh, the second function is to try to promote a positive image for law enforcement officers instead of a ne negative image. And the other uh, purpose here is I try to, you know, educate students as far as, you know, the laws and concerning, you know, tobacco, alcohol, and drug uh, use and abuse of it. Unfortunately, nowadays students they're uh, they're influenced more by their friends and by peer pressure than even when I was a teenager. So uh, the most, you know, the most dangerous thing uh, here at school, I believe, is the uh, students who participate in, in drugs and experiment with drugs. Uh, what I may take for my blood pressure, right, if you took the same pill, it may kill you, you know. And students don't realize how dangerous it is just to take a medication that's not prescribed to them. Uh, it, could, it could alter their whole life, you know, and change their whole life and, and their family. You know, they have to think about their family and their brothers and sisters and their aunts and their uncles, how this is going to affect their lives also. But they don't. You know, they just think about what, you know, is in it for me right this, this second. So, you know, we need to try to get the message out to teenagers to, uh, to think twice about making some of the uh, choices and decisions that they, uh, that they do. Well, over the years, uh, you know, and that's my primary purpose. I, that's why I got into law enforcement, to try to uh, help people. You know, that's what, what we all try to do. But also, uh, you know, over the years, I've helped quite a few people, I believe, and those that I didn't help, I put in jail. And I believe that kind of helped out uh, at least the victims. But one of the things that I'm most proudest of was in 1988, uh, there was a house fire in Casey, and at that particular time we were public safety. It was about one o'clock in the morning. And uh, when I arrived, I was the first one there, and the parents were in the front yard, and they couldn't get back inside the house to get their children because the house was completely engulfed in flames. So, uh, like I said, I don't know how exactly it happened, but uh, like I said, I know the Lord was with me because I went into the house three times, found the three children, and got them out, uh, and all three of them survived, and I did too. So, uh, like I said, I, I'm not going to take credit for it because, you know, I don't believe I did it by myself. But other than that, uh, over the years, I've, I've, uh, I've been able to help, help a few people, and I'm hopefully that I'll still be able to help more people before I finally give it up.